I don't believe that that's possible. Not hurting the family dynamic, but I truly don't think separation of business and family is really easy to do. Right. So I think part of it is just understanding and having everyone have the understanding that both parts are going to bleed into one another. And I think yeah. it's one of the greatest things that's happened about growing this business in front of my kids is yeah. that by osmosis alone, if nothing else, they have learned what piss and vinegar and work ethic is because they've <laughs> seen it happen. Right. They've seen dad have to leave a, a t-ball game to go show somebody a house that that turns into three or four other opportunities that are paying for vacation. Yeah. We tried a few years back and we got to get back into this. My daughter was the one responsible for grabbing everybody's cell phones and putting them in a basket when we would ah, sit down at the dinner table. I love that. But every once in a while, there's a call that I got to take, right? And you say like, guys, look, I understand that we should have a separation here, but this is going to pay for vacation or this is going to pay for your first year of college. Yeah. Or whatever it is. So right. I don't see a real separation. The thing I'm getting better at right now is just setting expectations with my clients that after seven o'clock or 7.30 on a weeknight, or on right. weekends, I'm not going to answer and just understand I'm going to listen to the messages, but I'm not going to get back to you until I'm available starting again at seven o'clock on Monday morning.